Hello Tube Mint, my name is Molly. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install Microsoft PowerShell 7 okay, on Windows 10. So this is a cross-platform PowerShell that you can use on anywhere. So you can see it is available on GitHub. It's not the same PowerShell that you have on your Microsoft Windows, okay? This is the latest release that you see, PowerShell 7.4.1. And you can see it is available for almost all the platforms, Linux, etc, etc. And this is what you need if you want to download and install download it install and install it on windows 10 it's also available on 7 8 8.1 and 11 so there are a few options these are the packages available uh, you can install it with winget msi package uh, this is what we have we have so, so same thing this is the latest one uh, this is 64 bit this is 32 bit so i will download 64 bit you can download it from github or this microsoft windows uh, page i will leave the link in the description install powershell 7 you can see Oh, it's available on ARM. That means you can install it on Android as well. That's great. Okay, so here we go. This is to install PowerShell 7. Obviously, this is going to be installed in this directory. You can change it register powershell event logs manifest add powershell to path environment variable yes open here just menu powershell files so we are going to go with the default enable updating powershell through microsoft update use my banner okay and install it this is 64 bit you can see it's clearly written over there so this is powerful stuff. Simply go ahead and say yes on the UAC. And you are good to go. PowerShell lets you run all your bash commands and Microsoft DOS commands as well. Microsoft Windows command prompt commands and your generic bash commands as well. Okay, launch PowerShell. This is what we have PowerShell 7.4.0. This comes from this directory. It's very, you see, That's the first one under my user directory. I'll have to say text up and then it's, it's faster. Ooh, you can see it's faster. So, this is how you can download and install PowerShell 7 on Windows 10. When you look up for PowerShell now, let's see what you get. This is what you get. This is not 7. This is not 7, okay? So make sure you go ahead and pin it to the start or wherever you want. And then you can put it on your taskbar. So that's what you have here. Hmm. Great guys, let me see. So it is going to work with all the commands that I have available with command prompt, 
inbuilt power cell power shell and this power shell 7 that we have so thank you so much for watching my friend